gonna say like we don't talk about Bruno. <laughs> I'm so upset. That's actually what they should do is uh some Encanto related products. All right, anyways, go ahead. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's Tiffany Mia. For today's video, we will be doing a unboxing. And Mr. Popco. For today's video, we will be doing a review and unboxing of our latest purchase from Confectionery Soap Company. If it's Confectionery Soap, you know I have to be in the video. Now, just as a reminder, for today's video, we are just doing a unboxing and review. But if you want any information about Confectionery Soap as a company, that was in our first Confectionery Soap video, which we will link up here and down below as well. Now, let's get started. Okay, so you already know before the box is even open, it's like my favorite thing. I love the tape, the confectionery soap tape. Okay, but in proper candle review video fashion, the box has already been pre-cut. They always surprise me with how it's like packaged in here so nice. with the bow, the paper, the confectionery soap sticker. It says winter wonderland. Now, did we order any winter stuff or is, did we try like new things? Since our last video was a lot of winter things, I think we ordered a lot of things that we wanted to show new to you guys. Is that, okay. This is from her Winterland launch. That oh, happened yeah, yeah, okay. at the beginning of the month. Yeah. All right. See, that bow is too nice to mess up, but. I know. Wait. See, you opened the tape a little bit more respectfully that time, right? <laughs> last time was ridiculous. So like always, uh, we have a brochure with the launch so this was the winterland collection the brochure is just going to go over her most popular products for this launch so it's like you're explaining this to me i'm like oh, oh very interesting <laughs> okay so there was a private note but i think on the back side of it had our information so we probably won't be posting it but thank you so much kelly we really appreciate yes, it thank you and uh i'm ready to get into this stuff i feel like me this too. is fine i just love it. okay let's do it so she always includes some samples in the packages that she sends over so these are bath fizzies. Um, yeah, I'm sorry. While you were showing that, I had already read this mm -hmm. and I'm so down. What is it? Pumpkin Crunch Berries Hair Serum. Now, while I don't have any hair, well, you I have, have hair, hair. <laughs> but not like long hair like yours, um, I probably won't be using it. But you can smell but it. But I can least. smell it. Isn't that weird? <laughs> <It's> weird. <laughs> the Bayou Princess. Bath fizzy. Now I'm assuming this is here. You show. I'm assuming this is like um, Princess and the Frog. Yeah. Related or inspired. I'm excited to use these. Yeah, I love that we get samples every time so that we can try new things, maybe even for our next video, mm -hmm. or if we just want to try it in house. Autumn breeze. Okay, this is another um, roll on, like how we had in our last video. Oh, cool. Yeah. So now we have two of them. You can stop stealing the one that we have. <laughs> I love these. I'm gonna set the box down so that we can just pick stuff out of here and just be hands free. Oh, oh, perfect. These are like those wax melts. You know, we got some from the last video. We, we actually got a lot of wax melts in our last video. So we decided to get a wax melter finally. Yeah. And it's been amazing. So I'm happy that we actually have more wax melts now because we bought the whole contraption. This is Sweet Fireside. Mm -hmm. Okay, I wonder if it's like the Fireside Marshmallow. They have like a fireside marshmallow, they right? Do, yeah. yeah, from our I think our we very first video. <laughs> yeah, we, bur we burnt it out. But it's like one of my favorite scents. I like anything marshmallow mm -hmm. fireside. I think Bath and Body Works even has one. Um, but I'm intrigued to see sweet fireside. What's gonna be the difference? Let's see. Okay. Oh, hold up. That has a very that has a very <laughs> Yeah. I love like foresty, woodsy kind of smells. Mm -hmm. And this is less, um, cause like I feel like Fireside Marshmallow, since it has that marshmallow element, it's like a sweet, mm -hmm. but this is very just woodsy, yeah. no sweetness to it. And it's a good size. Yeah, yeah, this is actually one of the bigger ones. Yeah. You can see it compared to like one of these. Yeah. It's like a thicker sample. Nice. What is this? This is from her new line okay. called Fantasy. Well, it's like, she has a bunch of different, um, products under this line so i'm really excited to try this one because i've been seeing it all over instagram too okay i guess our next purchase yes oh my god it smells so good it smells like yeah uh, when did this come out <laughs> <laughs> well they sold it um during this collection did too. they yeah how did i not we just 
We bought so much stuff. <laughs> okay, not to take away the shine from this wax melt right here, because this scent is actually phenomenal. I have to talk about our last experience, our latest experience with mm -hmm. confectionery. So buying, like our buying experience. So I think, my, at least my, check the shirts guys, check the shirts. My biggest thing was buying that little chef candle. I'm gonna oh be real, God, yes. I'm gonna be honest. I really wanted to get this. So we go into the website, this is a quick story. We go into the website and <laughs> <laughs> we see a couple of things that we want that we weren't even able to get in this pack right here because guys, when I tell you, and I think we said this even in our first video, as soon as we put things into our cart, they were selling out. It was like, we would try to complete the sale and it was like sold out. Can't get that no more, sorry. So at, I think at a point we were just putting something in our cart and checking out and then putting a new order and checking out and putting a new order and checking out. I think we put place like four orders yeah. before we were able to get uh, most of the things that we wanted and still some of them we weren't able to get. So guys, when you buy from Confectionery Soap, first of all, it's a good thing that they're selling out. That means their products are very popular. Very good. But also you have to be quick. You have to go in there with a plan, know kind of what the things you want to get and make sure that you're able to execute when you put your things in your car, check out, do it however you can to make it as fast as you can mm -hmm. because those things are going to sell out. Going off on what you said, Confectionery Soap does have an Instagram account, which we will link down below for you guys. They promote some of the products that will be in the launches and that way you guys can plan accordingly for launch day. Okay, with that out of the way, back to our review. So I think the last wax melt that we had here from the samples was 100, 100 Acre acres. Woods. Yeah. I'm assuming it's like about, well, we, we got the lotion oh, yeah, on that really one. Oh yeah, really good. That was the one that I think I put up my nose. <laughs> <laughs> I still want to smell it again. Here, let me do the honors. Yeah, I like that. That's, is that woodsy? Do you think that's like kind of woodsy? No, I smell. Is it floral? You're in a lot, but I smell pineapple. Do you smell pineapple? Not even close. Do you smell woodsy? Well, no, it smells like. Is it a combination? It is, wood, it is wood, well. A woodsy and fruity? It might be pineapple. Now that you, you say it. You love pineapple. I do, I do, but I, that's what I'm saying. I would know it like, off rip, don't you think? Maybe it's very subtle. Maybe no, the woodsy. I think, I think it's just so floral. You smell floral? I'm, I'm always wrong when I do this. <laughs> I think it might be just that much floral that it mm. gives it that sweetness. It could be pineapple. Kelly will know. She'll, she'll tell us. Wow. Wow, so Kelly included a gift in this package for us, and it's a pumpkin pie body scrub. We're not worthy. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Kelly. We really appreciate it, and I can't wait to use this. See, I'm, cause this has like a little film on it. Should we, oh, I'm scared, cause it's like. I think we should open it, cause it does have a lid. Guys, if you follow my YouTube channel, Shameful Plug, uh, Mr. Popcorn, <laughs> I'm a collector and I love seeing things like in its original packaging, but I guess gotta we, we it. gotta use it, we gotta open it. Where's the spoons? I just want to eat it. It smells that good. Yeah, it's really good. It's really good. <laughs> to, yeah, you sniff it now. That was actually super nice. We're gonna keep rolling only because that little chef candle's calling my name. I feel like we should save that for last. We I sure. feel like that's gonna be, that has to be the piece de resistance. See, now that I know is French. Is it Ratatouille French? This all came in bubble wrap, so very secure. I'm assuming because whatever's in here is fragile, even though I'm kind of opening it like, <laughs> it's not. Oh. oh, wow. Oh, these are, okay. These are obviously some of the bath fizzies that we ordered. No, the bath bombs. Oh, is that what they no, are? No, they brought, no, yeah. Yeah, bath. Bath fizzy. Bath, all right, bath fizzy. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm the pro at confectionery <laughs> soap. Ginger Mickey. Okay, so it's like gingerbread it Mickey. I don't know, do you want to open it? Yeah, I just want to see what it smells like. I wonder if once you release the air. No, because it's it... like packaged Oh, okay, air, yeah, so... yeah. <laughs> I guess I'm, I'm the pro. pro. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, it smells like a gingerbread cookie. Okay. I'm hungry now. <laughs> yeah, oh wow. That's, That's really, really good. good. Hey, Jinx. <laughs> I love that it's like frosted. It actually looks like a cookie. Yeah. yeah. Can you show it to them yet? You can't really see it because of the glare. Sorry for the glare, guys. We're trying to figure out how to do this setup for to better these reviews for you guys, but 
this is beautiful. I think this is, these are like almost like works of art. Like, do I really want to use yeah, them? Yeah, she hand paints them all. So Does she really? It takes I time. did not know that. Wow. So she's an artist. Ginger mini. So I guess they go hand in hand. Yeah, I think it's the same scent. It just looks different. So that's the ginger mini. Are we going to smell it? Or do you think it might smell exactly the same? We can smell it. Why not? Alright, we're gonna give it a sniff test. Yes. This one's, I think this one might be a little bit different. Really? Yeah, smell that. Let me get back to Nikki. Hmm. This one is, I think this one's more this is the, like, hot ginger, and that one has, I think it has like essence of chocolate. Mm. This one I think has more cinnamon. Smell that. That's almost like gingerbread and cinnamon. Here, mm -hmm. hold this one. Yeah, this one has some, some chocolate. chocolate in it. Yeah. Oh, oh wow. wow, so it's actually a big difference. I'm glad we opened them both yeah. and didn't assume that they were both just gonna be gingerbread. They're both very unique smells. One is, I think in my opinion, a little bit more cinnamon and this one is, I think has like an essence of like some hot cocoa maybe. I really enjoy they that. They both smell really good. So this one, is this, is this your favorite princess? It is, Jasmine is my okay. favorite princess. Show them. So I'm gonna show you guys. Another bath fizzy. How I think that's cute. the, what is it, the whole new world? Yes. Super cute. Let's smell this. Can I do the honors since it's my favorite? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm. First of all, is it good? It smells delicious. Don't try to decipher it yet. No, I just. You, you gotta let it marinate. Okay. What do you think that is? Hmm. It's good. It's it's, it's, it's really sweet. Mm -hmm. It's a sweet scent. Which is not what I was expecting. What was I expecting? What were you expecting? I feel like I was expecting... Like fresh? Like... Yeah, maybe like floral. But I feel like it's... It's sweet. I, it's I think I'm gonna have to take this out of the bag, guys. That's... It's really good. I can't... I can't... You can't pinpoint. No, I can't pinpoint what the scent is. Smell the back. I think there's like a little hole right there. I don't... I don't know exactly what it is, but I enjoy it. It's like... Maybe floral, it's, maybe it is floral. No, no, no. It smells like baked, like something baked, like a baked good. Oh, is okay. that right? Does that kind of give you? Maybe. No. <sighs> okay, this is gonna sound weird. Okay, go for it. It smells like condensed milk. <laughs> like what I would use for like baking. Really? Yeah, that's a weird, that's a weird scent to say. It's not, guy. I don't know if that's, that's weird. I it enjoy smells this though. good. It smells really good. It smells really good. It That's smells the really whole good. Point. I, I can't. I think not all. We can't all. We can't guess them all. Yeah. You know. I think if you do guess them all, then. It's but just the like closest thing scent. that we can think of is baked goods. Yeah. This one we did not order. Funky looking donkey. Is this um, Sven? From uh, I think from Frozen. So. That's uh, so cool. Show them. That's so cute. <laughs> That looks like him too. That's funny. I'm curious to yeah, see what go this ahead. is gonna smell like because. Thank you, Kelly, again. Yeah, thank you again. I <laughs> funky looking donkey. See, I like how you just rip through it. I try to like take off the sticker. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. This definitely smells more like bath related. I think. I'm getting like. You know what it kind of smells like? Um, it's gonna be weird, but kind of like Tiger Bomb. What does Tiger Bomb smell like? You know what Tiger Bomb is? No. Obviously, you're not an athlete. <laughs> it smells like a spa, kind of. Do you, do you get that? Yeah, I, I get like a. Um, it's definitely a stronger scent than the other bath bombs. It's like a relaxing. Yeah, relaxing kind scent. Of, Does, this does smell like some kind of like um, aromatherapy, aromatherapy kind of like cream. Yeah, it smells mm -hmm. something like that. What is this? Is this another oil? Ah, oh, yes. Okay, I love confectioner soap oils. Over the orange groves. Oranges. Yeah, just straight it's oranges. So, it's so good. Okay. Yeah, you know, I wonder if this would be good, um, like mixed. 
mixed with a different oil. Yeah, like Maybe. like you know how you can like do like eucalyptus and lavender and like tea tree oil, like mix it with like peppermint Maybe. and mix them all to make a specific scent. I feel like if you mix this with I don't know. We're gonna we're gonna become scientists. I think we're gonna try a few, and uh, maybe in our next video we'll let you know what we mix this with to create a unique scent. Very like spring. Yeah, um, I think another. We have to mix it with another confectionery and so forth. No. Mm -hmm. A thousand and one nights. Is that what I said for the bath fizzy? Are they named? Are they named the same thing? No, this is a whole new world. A whole new world. Okay. And this is a. A thousand and one nights, which I'm assuming. Is, is this body wash? Yeah, this is a body wash. I'm assuming this is jasmine, jasmine, yeah, like Aladdin related. That's awesome, like Arabian Nights kind of thing. Mm -hmm. A thousand and one nights, I don't know. And it's like glittery, it's beautiful, kind of got like the same colors as the bath fizzy. So, yeah. it smells very fresh, very nice. Oh, yeah, this, this is very full. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very floral. This is, um. Why do I keep doing that? <laughs> we actually got the Avatar Flight body wash in our last purchase and it was absolutely amazing. Yeah, it's become like our new favorite body wash. Yeah, so I can't wait to use this one. What is this? <laughs> oh my gosh. What is this? It's, okay, breakfast at Mickey's house, bath bomb in a bottle with Mickey syrup, bubble bath, and a little spoon. Guys, this is a whole set. Oh my Show them gosh. That. With a little spoon and everything. Look at the set, guys. Okay, so that's to take a bath. I, yes. okay. I cannot wait. I don't even take baths, but I, I think I want to try that one. Just because I love like breakfast and food wow. related scents. And it's basically syrup and waffles. That so. is so cute. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to use this. With the little spoon, how cute is that? Thank you so much, Kelly. That was Thank another you. gift from you and we really appreciate it. Now don't say anything because I know you like to make fun of me. <laughs> uh, this is lip balm that we got. Oh okay, gingerbread lane frosted cranberries. I'm excited. I think I'm gonna try the gingerbread lane on camera for you guys because Yeah. We actually got a sample in our last uh, package and I completely fell in love with it, which is why we ordered two more. Yeah, that was, uh, which one was it, the grape one? Yeah, it was the, yeah, yeah grape scented. Uh, okay, so gingerbread lane. Oh, this one has like a little plastic over it though. Excusez-moi. <laughs> it's a decent size too. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I haven't seen one this shape before. Like, it's literally like a glue stick. It is. <laughs> wow, that smells really it good. Smells really good. I probably should have let you smell it first before I like it's okay. <laughs> smeared my mouth all over it. Really good. The lip balms are also vegan, so that's pretty cool. Okay. They smell delicious. Yeah, this one smells great. I try not to eat them <laughs> because, like, I'll put it on and then, like, lick it right off immediately, so. I don't get the effects of the actual lip balm. This is frosted cranberries. Okay, here, you can do this first sniff. Thank you. What do you think? I can definitely smell the cranberries. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that's really good. It's like almost like sweet, very sweet cranberry. Mm -hmm. They're so nourishing to these lip balms and they last, you know, they're, they stay on your lips for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, now we're going to get into the things that we Absolutely. know about. Yeah, this is the professional stuff right here. These yeah. are the professional reviews. <laughs> All right, 100 acres. <laughs> so do you want to go first? You go ahead, do you know? See, now, smelling it as a candle, mm -hmm. I'm not getting the pineapple. Okay. It's very sweet. Floral though, like floral sweet. Mm -hmm. Does it have honey? I feel like it would have to, right? Because it's 100 acres. Here, Let's you see. guys know. I want to show you guys the label first. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm not a pro. It just has like a forest. 
right, so let's see what this smells like. It's definitely floral. I don't get any pineapple from it this time around. All right. So, but it so smells no really good. And I like the wooden wick. Yeah. It always comes with wooden wicks. I wonder, do they have cotton? Yes, we did get one with a cotton wick. I think we haven't, we haven't done that one yet because we're trying to go through them as we buy them so that they're, you know, we kind of remember what collection we have at what time. But we'll get around. We'll get around to it. Okay. We actually got two of these. Because I was so optimistic. This is this is what I've been waiting for. <laughs> Although I, I loved everything so far. This is literally what we've been waiting for. Okay, here, you get one and I get one. Okay. And I think we sniff this at the same time. I'm so excited for this. Ratatouille is one of my favorite movies, so. Yeah. Oh, I love the label. Here, you show them. You show them the label. Remy. How cute. All right, are you ready for this? I love the title, Little Chef. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three. Oh my God. <laughs> it smells like a Literally bread, like bread. bread. Baked bread. This is phenomenal. So let me tell you guys, um, I don't know if this is actually is this nation a nationwide thing or maybe we have a place called the candle pour let us know down in the comments if there's a local candle pour in your city but it's actually where you create your own scent they give you a bunch of like variety of oils that you can use to create your own candle and the first candle I ever created was probably the best candle I ever like smelled and it had baked bread essence in it mm -hmm. this is that but obviously perfected because when I did it, you know, I'm an amateur at candle making. Mm -hmm. Kelly, with this, you're a pro. Like you Amazing. are, you're the goat. Ah, it smells just like yeah, bread. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm happy that we got two of them because I feel like this is the one we're probably going to burn the most. Yeah. Now, if you remember my last video, which one was the one that I said was like my new favorite? Was it the blueberry, the blueberry. waffle, mm -hmm. pancake, something? Guys. This is our new favorite. This is definitely probably my... I just love the smell of like fresh baked goods and mm -hmm. fresh baked bread. Yeah, this is amazing. This is amazing. This is, I was not expecting it to be this good. <laughs> I wasn't expecting bread, were you? Um, I I thought of it like, hey, if it's gonna be anything, I hope, I was, not that I expected, I think I was hoping for it. I was like, I want a bread smelling candle because of the one that I made at the candle for. Mm -hmm. I was like, I want that, but for somebody to do it the right way, you know, professionally, so. This is awesome. And that is going to conclude our video for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this content, please like, comment, and subscribe. And Mr. Pop Call, thank you so much for joining me today. No, you're welcome. You know if it's a confectionery soap video, I've got to be in it because I just love their products. And this, this sealed the deal right here. This is like, <laughs> so good. oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Kelly, for all the support and the goodies that you included in today's video. Yeah, thank you so much. We really appreciate it. Guys, make sure to check out Confectionary Soap's website as well as their Instagram. It will be linked down below for any future launch dates and new products. Make sure to hit that bell notification so you're notified when any future videos come out on Tiffany Mia's channel. And stay tuned, there will be a launch fly collection Ooh. video coming out soon. Yeah, I'm excited for that. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Bye.